Hey, this is John Bollinger with Premier Guitar. Today we're taking a first look at the brand new Guild USA D50 standard. I'll tell you all about it after you take a second to subscribe below and we'll keep you apprised of all the cool new gear that's out there. So Guild has been making the D40 and the D50 for 60 plus years. There, they had several models. There was the Richie Havens, uh, kind of based famously on his Woodstock guitar, um, as well as like the Bluegrass Special, the Bluegrass Jubilee. Uh, but what makes this significant is this is the first American built D50 in over 10 years. 10 years ago, the last one was made in Connecticut, but Cordoba's purchased Guild and they have opened up now in California and this is built in California and they really did it right. So the D50 starts with a solid Sitka spruce top with a really beautiful tight grain, just looks great, very resonant. And they went with a forward shifted Adirondack spruce bracing. The back sides, fretboard and bridge are all solid Indian rosewood. And it is just, just beautiful wood. I mean, check that out. And I love that. I love that they went with that classic stripe in the back. And the final ingredient, Guild went with their vintage gloss, ultra thin nitro finish. And it has both kind of a satin and a glossy characteristics that really highlight the natural beauty of the wood. But I think more importantly, that really thin nitro is going to age so well. And it will it will really open up the more you play it it's a this is just out of the box and it it sounds great but i bet if you have this thing and play it hard for a decade it's going to be an amazing guitar because that that nitro just opens up really well and you've got the perfect tone woods under it so it's a really good combination um and the final ingredient that i like is that they they went with their old school case which to me is so much like like they were back in the day and it's i don't know it's kind of a kind of a cool throwback i like it's a it's got a vintagey vibe to it that just suits this guitar okay enough of my talking let's just hear this thing a little bit i find what i look for an acoustic guitar is i i want i want balance i want the low notes and the high notes to be kind of the same volume and and also to have that definition and I think they really nailed that But you really do, you can kind of hear every note. It's got its own place. You know, whether you're doing that kind of finger style stuff or just strumming, it really gives you like a defined definition of every, every note. That's kind of, that's kind of what I'm going for. Um, also, you know, for a, a, this is a, you know, a true acoustic guitar. There's no, uh, no pickup that comes in it. And so it is really perfect, you know, for singer songwriters, I mean, it, it is a perfect living room guitar. However, honestly, if I had it, I would put a pickup in it because it's it would be a, be a great gigging guitar. But to me, it's the volume of it really suits a voice. And if you if you uh, dig into it, it gets loud enough to cut for a bluegrass jam as well. So. It kind of ticks all the boxes. So let's just take it through a few more paces.
it also works well for like a bluesy slide thing. See, on a thing like this, even the bad notes sound good. So, <laughs> good on you, Guild. Uh, it comes in um, for the uh, standard natural finish, it's $2,799. For the antique burst, it's $2,899. And I would actually pop for the antique burst because it's just, it just looks great. So, good on you to read the full written review. Go to premierguitar.com. While you're online, make sure you follow us on Facebook and Instagram and your Twitters and your all that jazz. Poke around the old PG site, subscribe to our YouTube channel, subscribe to the magazine. It's John Bolger, till next time.